Hello YouTube, as you subscribe and everybody else in the remaining social network, it's Dark King and today in the background you are once again seeing another video of Battlefield Kotic Armada 2 forging a sequel and it's quite interesting, you know, it's basically a background story so to speak of the sequel but that's not the best part the best part is we finally get to see some of the in-engine in cutscenes with what I assume is an in-engine cutscene, like in the first one. And the best part is, they revealed something quite interesting. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be able to play as the Phalanx, what seems to be confirmation of uh, the Gloriana, and a freaking Space Hulk! <laughs> they weren't kidding. The big bastards are coming to the game and for what the models look like bigger and better than ever you know a speck hole is supposed to be a planetoid covered with guns and that's not an exaggeration and while gorians are op battleships and well the phalanx basically that's the imperium death star let's not mess around this thing is stupidly big even throughout the show the brief moment they show it fighting it's smaller than what it should be but uh, then again, that's in a bit smaller than what it should be from this angle, but... And again, it, it's the Imperium's Death Star. They can't exactly put it in the middle of the battle, it just wouldn't work. Uh, I mean, freaking awesome. And then that, we got Pape Pou Francais, Parfaitement, we got the Tyranids, we got some of the models, those, and some more corporate spiel to get us pumped up. <laughs> and honestly, it's working. I'm dying to, to get my hand on this game. It's gonna be bloody awesome! You didn't think like the first one. I mean, I sunk uh, over 60 hours into the game. And I usually don't play the multiplayer of games at all. I'm mostly a single player guy. But show me the phalanx and you get my full and undivided attention. I mean, seriously. <laughs> anyway, people, this was once again me just giving the two cents about the footage. We got to see several of the factions going pew pew at each other. We got the Eldar versus the Necron, the Necron versus the Tau, the Imperium versus the Tyranids. It's, well, technically the Imperium. Well, it's the Space Marine, but yeah, technically the Imperium versus the Tyranids and the Necrons at the same time. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. I'm gonna suck. I'm probably gonna suck at half the, the races, but. <laughs> Let's face it. If they managed to improve on the first one like uh, they seem to have, I mean, they were quite sound, sound for over an year here. And if this is what they were working on, it makes sense. Still, the game is supposed to come out uh, this year and this is pre-alpha footage. Maybe older footage and then again, like I said, they already had uh, the foundation in the first battle with Kotic Armada. They probably, not probably, most certainly didn't have to rewrite the code from scratch. So, it's a lot of time saved. Smart. Honestly, as a game developer myself, if I was to work uh, nowadays, if I were to work on a sequel, I wouldn't uh, throw the first one away. I mean, the animations, all the effects, and a huge portion of the code, but it's already there. I'm not gonna have to. I'm not gonna rewrite the whole thing if I don't have to. Anyway, this one, we, ah, dang it, this long-winded video has gone on for long enough. Leave me in the comments, tell me, are you pumped for Battlefield Gothic Armada 2 or get, did you get burned by the first one? Honestly, can't wait to get my claws on it. Until then, hope you enjoyed it and, well, until any other news or one of my let's plays, I'll see you around. Ta-ta!